We love to look feminine, but I think we're so man. Yeah. And together we spend 140,000 euro on plastic surgery. And we are the German plastic, plastic boys. boys. I just want to look fake and plastic. I want to have the biggest lips in the world. I won't be living forever, but my implants will. Hi Patrick, how is Stefan? <laughs> I literally shake. <laughs> Hey, hey hope on the look. Do you, Do you guys, guys recognize, recognize us? I would describe my look as very androgynous. Also, es gibt wirklich gar nichts, was mich stoppen könnte auf meinem Weg zum Plastic sein. My name is Patrick Maas, also known as Barbie Boy Frankfurt. I'm Stefan Streubel. I think I've changed quite a bit, but don't you think I look great now? One day I want to look like Jessica Alves. I just want to look fake and plastic. And I'm gonna reach that goal one day. Hi Patrick, how is Stefan? A little bird told me that you both are a big fan of mine. Well, I'd like to say thank you very much. And you both look absolutely amazing. So please do let me know next time that you are in London. Let's go for a glass of champagne. Send you lots of love. <laughs> oh my God. I just love Jessica. I literally shake. <laughs> She's like my plastic idol and... Oh my god. Girl, we have to go to London, please. Because I want to have that glass of champagne with her. I mean, our plastic queen says we look amazing, so... Well, she's a legendary Jessica Alves, and I've been following her since the beginning, like, before her transition. She's just, like, my idol. She's just the definition of being plastic and iconic and beautiful, amazing. I just love her. I love her so much. It's a big honor for us um, to get, like, a positive feedback, especially from her because because she, she says beautiful things about us, confirms that we did the right things. Definitely, we're on the right way to plastic. Since last time I had a cat eye lift, I had a buckle fat removal, I had a lip lift, I had my teeth done, I had liposuction on my chin, I had liposuction on my tummy, and I'm about to get a gastric sleeve. And of course, way more Botox and way more fillers. I did a lot to my face, fillers and Botox as usual. And I also had a full facelift. I got all my teeth done. I love it and it's the best invested money, I think. Yeah, I mean, you look so amazing, girl. I want your cheeks. <laughs> For a living, I work in a car dealership. It's quite boring, but it gets the money. <laughs> I'm working as a CEO of an intensive care service for children and yeah, I like it. I've been able to afford all the surgery because my grandfather passed away a few years and well, he left some money and I didn't mind to take that for my plastic surgery goals. My friends and family are very generous. They also give me the money for that. I used to do fillers myself because I wanted to save money and the doctors didn't want to give that stuff to me. So I just bought the fillers online and injected them myself. But now I have doctors who give me the right fillers that I want and make my lips even bigger. So today we are going to a very special photo shoot. It's going to be hard. Be excited. I'm pretty excited about photo shooting. I think it's gonna be hot and we're gonna be looking amazing. It's our first photo shoot together because we need a cover for our new upcoming podcast. Two plastic people in one picture is, in my mind, amazing. Best day ever. <laughs> <laughs> and now the photo shooting is going to be even better because oh, yes. now I got the energy. Oh my God, I think we need another glass of champagne. <laughs> <laughs> When I saw Stefan the first time, I was so happy because I finally found someone who has the same passion, my plastic sister. So girl, cheers on us. I love cheers. you so much. You know, the only kind of pain we want is champagne. That's right, girl. We're the first two German plastic gay boys. We're That's gonna amazing. take our crown and get it. <laughs> A lot of people question me um, if I'm trans or a man or woman. I still identify as a man because I'm born male and I don't want to change that. I love the feminine look. I don't want any boobs or feminine um, body features. I went uh, to a psychologist in the past and she definitely said, okay, you're still a man. You're not a trans woman. And we can still look feminine if we want to. Yes. We don't have to be trans for that and we don't have to be girls for that. So the funny thing is, I 
met Patrick because I saw him on Hooked on the Look. Um, and then we got in touch. And yeah. since then we love each other. So I have to say, I really hate going out, especially in the city, because I get so much negative comments on the street, like, oh my God, look at his lips and all that stuff and I'm really scared to go outside like I don't go there by public transport I just drive by my car sometimes um, I'm a little bit afraid because the people are very aggressive and yeah I don't know what they will do to me being alone in public I wouldn't recommend it for everyone who looks like us what makes us besties is that we have so much more in common than like the plastic surgery we have the same interests, the same hobby. And I think our biggest hobby is <laughs> dating men. <laughs> <laughs> and sometimes the same. Sharing is caring. Since I got more surgeries, I don't really get serious dates anymore. Like all the messages I get on dating apps are just like they want to use my lips, but nobody wants to seriously date me. With the feminine look, it's a little bit easier for me to find a man, mostly for fun, because they are just curious. For the serious stuff, it's definitely uh, much harder. But if there's any sugar daddy out there who wants to date me, call me, text me, I'll do whatever you want. I really get a lot of hate comments, but the thing is also when I'm bored, I go online and read them because your comments are just so stupid. Like they say, oh my God, you should get fillers in your brain. But guys, thank you for all those comments. I'm working on it. Most of the comments are very negative because the, most of the people say I look just ugly and yeah, like trash. But on the other side, there are a lot of people, uh, especially male people who say I'm looking better than her girlfriend. And I like that. People, get a mirror if you judge our looks. I'm sorry, but most of the people who judge us are like some middle-aged woman and they sit there alone at home on Facebook all day. With life crisis <laughs> on fleek. And mean to judge us. Sorry girl, I'm not going with that. <laughs> When I get buried and they dig me out 20 years later uh, and open my coffin, the goal is that everything is full with silicone. I think the photo shooting went amazing. The pictures turned out great. We were sexy, we were iconic. Just two plastic icons. I loved it, it was perfect. Together, uh, a big goal of us is also to get uh, German reality TV stars and show the people who's behind this plastic. Don't care about what other people, people say because plastic is fantastic and just do what you want get that filler even if the people hate you they're just jealous